Hi everyone, welcome to my crazy crafty life. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul. The first thing that I picked up was this big bag. This is huge and holds a lot of stuff. There's even a front pocket in here. Um, so, and they had other colors. I just happened to like the black. So I picked that up and I'm going to try and show you everything that is in here. So, yeah. <laughs> the first thing I got were these um, two-pack coffee mugs. They were reusable. They're probably hand-washed. Made in USA. Um, they are meant for hot things, so, you know, they're... As it says caution hot so these are meant to be reused probably hand washed though but I just loved all the fruits on it I thought it was very cute and summery um, the next thing I found let's see, I got more of these plastic plates to do um, to your tray with like a really simple one and they're the same size. They're the only plastic ones like this they have, but I thought these would be um, really cute like this, stacked up, so. Um, another thing I found, the summer item, their stirrers, their pink flamingos. They had a darker pink. They also had ones with like a little tiny spoon on the end um, with, uh, Sorry, the ice cream truck is distracting me. <laughs> oh my goodness, never a dull moment. Um, they had a pineapple one and I think they were palm trees. So they had a few more, um, but I got these um, just to stir my coffee. I thought it would be fun for the summertime just having it by the coffee area, so. Next things I got were more bandanas. Um, I showed this one in my last haul the pink with this, wow, why is that washed out? There we go. And this one, really pretty. And then I got another one of these and um, it comes with this one too. Yeah. And then I found this one it has the um, the flag. So this one has the stripes and the stars, and then this one has the buffalo check with the stars. I thought that was really cool. These would be really cool to make pillows with or whatever you want. <laughs> okay, I found some new craft items. And when I tell you, <laughs> it was quite a surprise. Oh, I found another one. This is a long scarf with the plaid. I love the plaid. Buffalo and check, buffalo check and plaid, they always get me. <laughs> but this would be awesome too. All right. So more craft items. There's quite a bit. So let's jump in. Found this one says home. It's a little metal and it already has the wreath. You could paint the wreath or leave it alone. I'm not sure what I would do. What would I do? Probably paint the wreath and leave the home. I'm not sure. We'll see. <laughs> but I thought that was a really cool find. Um, another thing is this chalkboard um, they're calling it a chalkboard tag. It's shaped like a mason jar. How fun would this be in a kitchen? Or um, you could put it um, on your fridge, put some magnets in the back. Um, there's a lot you could do with this. I thought it was really cool. Um, and then I found this chalkboard tag. It's a heart shape. They also had star shape, but I, I liked the heart, so I got that one. Um, and then I found a couple of these, which I thought were really cool wall decor. 
Um, they're just calling it a hanging, wood hanging. And this one's chalkboard. And then they have the dry erase board. How cute would these be in a command center together? Adorable. Or on a fridge. I mean, there's so many things you could do with these. You could even, I was even thinking if you took the black, making um, tear trays with it. I mean, you could do it with the white too, but getting like two of the same and making a tear tray or making, um, using the, maybe the plastic plates for the tear tray. I mean, there's a million things you could do. I found more fabric. It's crazy. I keep finding more fabric. I never ever remember Dollar Tree carrying this much fabric. Um, but these are the 100% cotton and they're very similar. Um, not the same. This is why I hate opening these. <laughs> I just want to open it because it's so cute and it's hard to see if you don't open it. But uh, look at that with the cats. And it's all pastel and uh, so cute in spring with the boots and everything and the pail. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. And then I found this one. That one has more pink in it and this one has more blue in it. Um, again, 100% cotton. Oh, this one's so cute. The little cute kitties. How cute. I love that. Oh, the little flowers. It's perfect. It's so beautiful. Then um, they had these around Christmas time, I want to say, but um, I haven't been able to find the buffalo check one again, and I finally found it again. So, oh, maybe it was for Father's Day last year. I want to say because they're they're ta they're calling it a men's travel bag. So I found another one and I thought how cool, like for a pencil case or um, craft supplies, whatever you want. Um, sorry about the crinklies. Oh my goodness, that's loud. But yeah, you have the handle and then it opens up, has a zipper. Um, you know, it's not like high quality, I would say, but it's pretty good and I mean if you wanted to put you know scissors or craft supplies in here um, tapes whatever you want I mean this this could hold it um cricket cricket stuff I mean there's a lot of room in here so you could probably fit a lot um colored pencils um, markers whatever whatever you need to carry with you all right um let's see I found this little Pin with the flowers. I thought it was just so, so pretty. The pinks, a little bit of blue and green. It's just perfect. I love it. Um, and then I found, these are goodies, um, ouchless um, hair ties. These are the bigger size and then these are the smaller. The bigger ones you get 10, which is a lot, I think. And then the smaller one you get 15. And they're the thicker ones, they're not the thin ones. And hair ties, I'm telling you, I wear them all the time. <laughs> so I stocked up. And then I found, um, these are green, bri green briar ones and you get 30, but these are the thinner ones. These are the thinner ones, um, and then there's no metal on the back because I always look for those too. I don't really like the metal. Um, I don't like it showing. I don't, so I don't like to get those. Um, and then I got, I got another one of these because I'm not even sure what happened to mine. Somehow it went missing. So I picked up another one of these scrunchies. I love, I love their scrunchies. That's a green bridal one as well. And I got more, they're calling them snap clips. And these are kind of matte, not shiny, which I kind of like, it's different. And you get two sets of the white, a gray and a black. So pretty good buy, I thought. Um, more craft items. You're gonna see that a lot. 
and I found these laser wood cut words that say family. How pretty are those? And you get two of them. So they're a pretty good thickness as well. I'm not sure if you can tell, but they're pretty good. So I thought that was really cool. Another thing I was so excited to see, I had no idea they were going to do this, but it's the DIY wood dice. Now they've always carried like the teaching tree ones that are foam and they're bigger, but how cute are these? If you do like wood burning, you can make dice with these. You could, I mean, there's so many things you could do with these. You could spell out something and stack them. There's so many things and you get three. Um, you can use them for legs. I mean, you could make a snowman out of this. I mean, there's so many things. So I was very excited to find these. Okay. Um, I also found, okay, let me see. I dug out some more stuff. I found these, they're calling them bobby pins and these are the scrunchy brand. And they really are, they're just like plain on the back. But I just, I thought they were cute. They're simple and cute, so. Um, and then another laser cut wood word, love. And you get two. So two projects. How beautiful is, I love, haha, no pun intended, love this, this one. It's so pretty. The font they use is perfect. Okay. Then I found another um, metal, there goes the ice cream truck again. Anyone want some? <laughs> um, I found this one. It says welcome. It's the metal with the wreath. And then this one has flowers. How cute would that be to paint in pastel colors? Okay, the next thing I found were these juncture socks. You get two pairs. This one's gray with the pink, two different pinks in a stripe. And then the other one is just this simple pink design. And then I found they're called Gideon Smart Basics. You get two. You get a black sock with a pink top. These are long. Um, and then striped with the... And they're also long. They're the same. So you get a striped one and a plain with a pink top. And I love big socks, long socks, especially in the wintertime. Keep your feet warm. You could wear these over, you know, with your boots. These would look so cute. So... Um, okay, what else do I have in here? Ooh, more bandanas. I knew I got more. <laughs> I got this one with the gnomes. And this one just has the stripes and the stars. And then you get, and then I got this one with the truck. There's a truck, there's a flag, there's all different things. There's the heart with the stripes, red, white, and blue. Um, and then you get this one with the stars and stripes. So, so what I was saying is that you could probably make some cute pillow covers and things with these. Um, I'm not sure, but I already bought pillow covers from Amazon, but if you haven't done that and you want to, you could literally just tie them at the corners. Super easy. You can change them out. Easy to store because they're not big. So... I like them. Okay. Oh, I got another scrunchie. This is from also from the scrunchie band, a uh, scrunchie brand, and it's um, like a bandana-looking pattern. Really cute. I thought that was cute, especially for the summertime. Then I found some makeup. LA Colors Cream Gel Bl Blush. This one's called Tainted Love. It's kind of pink. And where's the other one? Then I got one that's called Admirable. 
which is probably going to be the one I like the best, but I got both to try. They're not very big, so you're not making a huge commitment <laughs> as far as, and plus they're only $1.25, so if you really hate it, you don't have to use it anymore. All right. Um, I also restocked on these. I actually had a coworker who needed a spray. She said her car stunk. <laughs> um, and I said, well, yeah, here, just take it. I have another. So I got more just to keep them in my car. And she loved it. She said she could not smell anything after that. So recommend it, I believe. Not sure which one I had given her. It's one of these, but I swear they're they're exactly the same except for the um, except for the packaging because it says all the same stuff: kills viruses, disinfectant, fab fabric, and air freshener, eucalyptus scent. Like they both say that. So yeah, they're exactly the same. Just the packaging looks a little different. So. If you see these, you should pick them up because I've used them in my car too. I just like that it's a little mist. It's not crazy. Um, more makeup. I found this Revlon nail polish in this really pale. I hope my camera can pick that up. It's almost like an opal color. Like it's just shimmery. So I thought that was really cool camera do okay there we go yeah so it's just really subtle really nice okay and I picked up some sponges these are the scrub buddies for tough cleaning jobs and it says side grooves to protect nails and against scratches so like it has I don't know if you can see. So you, it kind of has like a handle so you can hold it so while you're cleaning. And they're both the same. They just have different colors. But I think, you know, having the different colors for different um, different types of jobs, like, I don't know, you can keep these in the kitchen and keep these in for other stuff, like I don't, at bathroom, you know, that kind of thing. And then I found the cutest little luggage tag. I haven't bought them in a while and I don't usually buy them because, you know, but this one was so cute. It's a gnome and he's holding a um, watermelon and his hat is even like a watermelon slice. It's so cute. I thought that was so adorable. So that got me. And, um, you know, on the this is what it looks like, the buckle part, and then name, address. It's very plain on the back. So I thought that was so cute. Okay. Um, another, I got a couple other new craft items. And I got this heart. It's ceramic. You can hang it up. Just like that. You could even do like dry erase and write on this if you wanted, or probably with a Cricut. I would probably do the Cricut over that because uh, I'm not sure how good of a quality this, sometimes there's like little cracks in the ceramic, especially with Dollar Tree ones, and then everything settles in there. And then when you erase it, it's kind of settles in there. So it doesn't look very good. So I'd probably use a Cricut. Um, and then I found this one, which they've had like the smaller version of this, um, but this one's bigger. And I don't know if you can tell, like from my hand, it like almost hides my whole hand. And this one has a kickstand. So really cute for a tear tray. It would fit in a tear tray for sure. It's just a little bit bigger than the other ones, which I've also used on tear trays. Okay, then I found some stickers. I might have a problem. Oh my goodness. I might have a little bit of a problem here. Okay, I'll start with these. So 
So I got these ones. They're like, they pop up. This one's like plants. And then I got this one with cars and motorcycles and scooters. I thought that one was really cute. And then I got this travel one, which I love. You can see all of the different ones on here. And then, those aren't stickers, okay. Then I found these that say, it's like a family themed. How cute are these? This one kind of looks like stacked books and then the family on the bottom. Really cute. And then I found some with sayings on them that were really cute. How sweet are those? Look at that. Coffee bar. There's so many. These would be adorable on a tear tray. Um, and then I got these vintage ones. How cute are those? And I found these that have kind of like a wood look, but they're but they're deck they're very ornate. I love that. These are so so cool. All right, um, I showed this one. I got some dupes. <laughs> and then I found this one, which I was looking for, but it wasn't where. It, it's Jot, so it should have been with the office supply stuff, but it wasn't. It was the only one I found, and it was in the craft section. So you really have to look, because you never know where you're going to find stickers. But look at how cute. I love the pink tree with the flowers, but all of them are super cute. I love those. Um, and then I found this one, which is similar to the other one. Just different, different um, quotes and things. How cute are those? Very cute. Um, and then I found these. I just loved the flowers. Absolutely beautiful. Then I think I might have hauled this one before. Um, says Grandma. Um, I just liked it because of the balls of yarn and stuff. I'm a knitter and I'm, I'm a sewer, so I really liked all of these things on here. Very nice. Um, oh, I found more stickers. These are cool because they're kind of iridescent. So, yeah, very cool. Um, I showed that one. Um, let's see. This one, how cute. Very cute. I'm taking way too long to do this. <laughs> They're so awesome. These I definitely have seen before, but I picked up, I don't know if I ever picked them up. So I kind of have that chalkboard feel to them, which is nice. That chalkboard um, thing I found um, in the craft section, you could probably put that in there it would look so cool. I showed that one already. Skip that one. Uh, okay, so then there's this one. Cherish, love, every moment, like all these beautiful sayings. And then this one, pain is real, but so is hope. And there's other ones. I love, love this one. Um, so much so I got triple. <laughs> and then I found this one. How cool are those? Anyways, that is all I have for today. I hope that you enjoyed. Please remember to subscribe, like, and comment. I appreciate all of your love and support. And I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.